California's 25th congressional district is one of the most competitive in the country. It most certainly is. It recently flipped from red to blue, but then a scandal forced the winner to resign. CBSN LA's Hermela Aragawi joins us now to explain why there are two races for this one seat. Good morning to you. Hey, good morning, you guys. Yeah, this is a very interesting race. When Katie Hill resigned, it triggered a special election to fill the empty seat for the rest of her term, which is until January. But voters also have to decide who they want to hold the seat for a two year term starting in 2021. <laughs> We'll start with the results for the special election. On top right now, Democrat Christy Smith with 34%, followed by Republican Mike Garcia. Since it looks like neither candidate will get an outright majority, they'll likely face off again in another election on May 12th. The person who wins will have the seat until January. And then here's the race to fill the seat starting in 2021 for a two-year term. Smith leads here as well, followed by Garcia. No one can win this outright. So the top two finishers here must go on to the November election, and the winner there will serve the full two-year term. Smith and Garcia are leading the pack of 12 candidates, but their work is far from over. Last night, we caught up with each candidate at their respective headquarters at Stevenson Ranch in Santa Clarita as they looked ahead to the next phase of their campaigns. Ground game begins now. Uh, like I said, we're going to stay in voter communication mode. We're going to continue to welcome all of these activists and folks from all over California who have had such a vested interest in this race, and uh, we'll just keep keep rolling program. I truly want what's best for my, my country. I want to protect the Constitution. Uh, I don't want to make sure that we can af continue to afford to live here in, the, in this great state of California, and uh, I want to keep taxes low. I want to secure the border, and I want to make sure that we continue to be the premier force on the international stage. Again, if the numbers hold in both races, Smith and Garcia will face off in May, and the winner there will have to immediately start campaigning to hold on to their seat in November. The 25th district represents Simi Valley, Santa Clarita, Palmdale, and parts of Lancaster. It was once a Republican stronghold, but Hill won it for the Democrats, and it's now seen as a battleground district.